fellow Kenyans, the forthcoming general election will be the first under our new constitution. As I conclude my remarks, I wish to assure the nation that the government will ensure peaceful, free, and fair elections, as well as a smooth transition. Towards this end, the government has prepared the assumption of office of President Bill, which will be tabled in Parliament soon, very soon. This bill, among other provisions, details how a president-elect will take over office and process, processes of handing over with clear timelines. As the government en engages in the task of infrastructure development, we must also all use these facilities responsibly. For example, owners and drivers of large vehicles must ensure that they do not overload their lorries, their vehicles, as this will damage newly built or rehabilitated roads. Moreover, all drivers must obey the highway, the highway code at all times and avoid reckless and dangerous driving. In this regard, I am very concerned over the rampant use of mobile phones by drivers while driving. We must also deal firmly with the persons who drive under the influence of alcohol. I urge traffic police officers to clamp down on these dangerous habits. We must recognize, however, that there cannot be traffic police officers at every junction and roundabout to control us. We must therefore develop a sense of personal responsibility and observe order on our roads. To this end, amendment, amended traffic regulations will soon be implemented. These regulations impose heavy and adequately punitive fines and jail term on traffic offenders. I am confident that they will deter motorists as well as pedestrians from disregarding the highway code. 